Time for a little background. 1997, that was the year the From the Heart program started. And like most success stories, it was created because of the passion and determination of people who truly care about our Glendale community. It recognized the years of commitment to the program and the, it says your work has touched and changed our community. So that made me very, very These proud. are happy memories for Mary Ann Levine. We received a grant to go to Washington, D.C., and that is... You see, in the late 90s, she was in charge of a group of community leaders who created From the Heart. They were inspired by a similar program elsewhere. The goal was to help people in need in Glendale. It's just wonderful to gather the people together who will help resolve the issue. When she came to me and she said, this program is going on in another city. Mayor Elaine Scruggs approved of Mary Ann's efforts to build from the heart. She was very excited about it and and very interested in in supporting the fact that we wanted to do that. And she let me know that it was my job to get this program started in the city of Glendale. And you see we had more far more than 11 yeah. agencies who submitted applications. Everyone wanted to get involved. They wanted to get involved. Everyone loved the concept that as little as a dollar a month donation through the city utility bill could provide hope through meals, clothing, utility, and child care assistance. The money that we collect and give out from From the Heart may be going to your next door neighbor. You just don't even know it. We're going to hand out the checks now, and before we do that, I'd like Now, to giving out the money, of course, that was the easy part. The business side was a little harder. A corporate sponsor was needed to provide enough money that donations could be matched 50 cents on the dollar. We knew where we wanted to go. We knew the end result, but getting there um, was sort of uncharted territory. There's a plaque to you that says, with sincere appreciation and gratitude. Fortunately, corporate donors joined in. And they were just a wonderful, wonderful partner for so many years. Since the beginning, several partners have provided matching funds. More than $750,000 has been collected from partners including the BHHS Legacy Foundation and the McCormick Foundation. And there's more to come with the city's newest partner, the Gila River Indian Community. Those corporate dollars are in addition to donations from citizens who check the box on their city water bill. Plus, you can also give a flat donation. That's something Mayor Scruggs knows the effect of firsthand. I did lose both my mom and dad within 11 months of each other. When Mayor Scruggs' parents, Alan and Marianne Palmer, passed away, she designed their obituaries to include that donations in their memory could be made to From the Heart. This would be a way that dad could continue to serve, you know, and, and it would make him happy. Nearly $14,000 was donated in honor of her mom and dad. And this money came from business people, you know, um, that do business with the city, and it came from residents who maybe sent $10, $15. But of course, that total grew. For me, it, it was a huge um, comfort to me. Because once again, every dollar was matched by 50% thanks to those corporate sponsors. This is a wonderful way for them to live on, for their memory to be honored. Who knows how many people from the heart has helped with new school clothes, teaching job skills, and providing a hot meal. And it says, you've shown the rest of the West Valley that poor economic times don't diminish your sense of commitment to the community and its people. How'd that feel? Great. Absolutely great. Isn't that wonderful? But for those who built this very special program, it's not a matter of how many people benefit. My grin from ear to ear when you say, from the heart? Well, I know about that. <laughs> it's important to know, from the heart, is available and it works. And so my hope is that this is a part of the fabric of the city of Glendale, government structure, and it'll never go away.